Hey guys, we are Dos Bananos and welcome to our reaction video to one of our most loved YouTuber. Dan is not on fire. Well, that was like a news reporter. Dan is not on fire. Yes. Yeah. We are watching, what was the name, the newest video, I nearly blinded myself. And I mean, we are both huge fans, like, you know, when the fan, don't mm, yeah. no, uh, We love Dan and Phil very much, yes. and so we thought we would react to it. We already did a reaction to a Dan is not a fire video, it was his diss track, if you saw it, I don't know. Um, but we thought we could just react to it and kind of then whoever watches it, probably only fans, um, just kind of interact with you and talk yes. about it and laugh about this little cute dork. And so it's kind of a hey, let's watch this shit together thing. And yeah, we're so excited because we were waiting for this to happen. Very long! No, no, sorry. We're so excited! Okay, so oh. let's watch our little dork be cute, oh amazing. He is so cute. I, I, I press the play button. Press the play button. Okay, I do it! Oh, Hello. I did something incredibly stupid. And today, Again. I would like to tell you the story. He's right though. <laughs> That's you. Yeah. Was under control. You mm -hmm. can't mm -hmm. fly. The last thing I always mm -hmm. pack is my mm -hmm. toiletries. So with the serene ambiance of Phil screaming in the background when the car is going to so I should just leave so... to get at the airport, I laid all of the products out in front of me and said, No, I can do this. Like a fucking ninja octopus, I was spraying my hair while Always with the octopus. I managed to pack toothpaste, mouthwash, and get some floss in there, and then I reached for my deodorant, and that was when it all went wrong. I'm not that coordinated at the best of times, but in this frenzy, I picked up the can of deodorant and pressed down to spray myself without realizing that I was holding it in the wrong direction, and I sprayed it into my eyeball. Danny. That's right. You're so retarded. I don't know if you've accidentally sprayed yourself with aerosol, but that shit's cold. And what made it worse is it was an antiperspirant to stop I didn't. sweat. Oh, so it okay, began then to I'm the only one. The moisture from my eyeball. I instantly uh. scream in pain and drop my stuff. It was <laughs> still, still freaking out, but now also mildly okay. concerned. Asked if I was okay, but I was like, no, I have come too far to lose now. I am going to do this. So I said. One minute, turned on the tap and started vigorously splashing myself in the face. I had no idea what I'd done or how bad it was, but I was like, I'm gonna clean my eye, get my stuff, and get in that car. So I grabbed my wash bag, went to go get my muffin, which I hadn't had a chance to eat yet, which Phil said was ridiculous, but no, I wanted my muffin, and I got the car. Priority. with my eye suspiciously twinging. I didn't want to raise any concern with Phil, so I just kept it closed and covered like I was quietly face palming about something in the corner. <laughs> to be honest, I do quite a lot of it. Uh, that sounds like and him though. Thankfully, and, you know, just oh, like I said, we were, so everything's fine. We made it in time for the flight. By which I mean we sprinted unceremoniously through the entire airport, <laughs> panting and sweating until we were sat down at the gate. I then decided to get my muffin out, thinking I definitely deserve to enjoy it after the incident. Only to realize I had somehow crushed it oh. in my bag. 
I would cry. I, I, I would have cried. I hate this. Throw it away, but oh no, it was much more than just a muffin at this point. It was a symbol that no matter what, I was not giving up today. And that That's was so when funny. I decided to open my eye again for the first time. Oh my God. I remember looking across to Phil, who had just begun to process that we had actually made it in time for the flight and calmed down, and quietly saying, I can't see out of my left eye. What? I sprayed deodorant to my eyeball before we left. What? <laughs> so instead of Bill's face of, oh my god, are you serious? Why do I even? All I saw was a beautiful white cloud of blur. At this point, <laughs> I started majorly freaking out, thinking that I'd permanently blinded myself, and for the rest of my life I'd have to explain that I did it by spraying deodorant into my face because I was holding a can in the wrong direction. I sprayed which, in the to be honest, would just be the cherry on the top of the reasons why Dan's a failed cake that is my life. Phil, oh, the muffin. Oh, the muffin. Like. Re freaks out himself as if I'd literally impaled something through my head and were imminently about to die right then. Orders that I go to the bathroom and rinse it out some more while he researches what I should do. So oh, no. Don't do that. Don't. Like you just end up having cancer. Or yes. Google said. Or, or die tomorrow. Or die tomorrow. Right. Yeah. This cloud in my eye is probably just the powder from the deodorant. So... I can rub it off and proceed to not just splash water in my eye, but vigorously scrub it. After five minutes of fingering myself, like I was trying to find a spot with the time limit, I sat there back down, and this is when my symptoms evolved from just not being able to see to also extreme pain. I had somehow made it worse, so my eye was blurry and burning. So I oh, sat I in the this. middle of an airport, rocking backwards and forwards, crying my eyes out. Now, in the UK, <laughs> despite various other fuck-ups, one thing we've definitely got right is free healthcare, and there is a service where you can call a number to get free medical advice in situations that else. aren't necessarily an emergency. So Phil passed me the phone, and I spoke <laughs> to a lovely old lady called Doris. Now, I Doris! Doris. Okay, don't get me wrong, I've used it before, like it's very helpful, time. protect the NHS and all that, but this particular lady wasn't very helpful. Hello, my name I can is imagine. Hello, I am. That cost him no It's awesome. Dan. Awesome. Ham? Dan. Just say Daniel, oh, damn it. Daniel. Thank Daniel, you. yeah, so what, what's the problem? I sprayed deodorant in my eye. Oh, why would you do that? It was an accident. Ah, I sprayed That's me. Why would you do that? I'm um, sure, okay. Uh, links. Yes, okay. Um, L. Thank you, Doris. Just get better naturally on its own, or you need urgent medical attention. How do I know if it's that bad? Eh? Not sure. Maybe you should just go to the hospital anyway. Well, that might be an issue as I'm flying to Australia in ten minutes. Do they have hospitals in Australia? Yeah, I don't no, know. No, just kangaroos. The flight if my eyes going to fall out. Do they have a hospital at the airport? No. Uh, well, uh, not really sure what you can do, really. <laughs> okay, well, thanks, Doris. Bye. <laughs> Daniel the dog. Daniel the friend. Deodorant in my eyes, so I shoved everything back in my bag and decided to go to a pharmacy in the airport, buy every eye product they had, and just use them all at the same time. Because fuck it, how could I make it any worse? I got eye drops, eye can, spray, actually. eye yes. pad, with roll-on stick, which I'm pretty sure was probably just makeup, and just went to town. Phil had me lying horizontally across a bench like Frankenstein's monster as he just <laughs> dropped things into my eyes. Well, at least he was concerned. That's when we got the announcement that our flight was boarding. I was getting on that flight, so we marched towards the gate, and that is when one of you guys just happened to bump into us and ask for a selfie. Now, I was having a bad day, but I wasn't going to say no to I this, saw that so selfie, I like, half an hour ago. Okay. And I just... Oh, and that's why. So he was literally so in pain in this picture. I saw him just like. Just winking with tears rolling down my face. <laughs> and we got on the plane. <laughs> this is when miraculously, as if it probably would have been fine if I didn't rub it so much, my vision started to clear up and I no longer felt any pain. Phil obviously took all of the credit for his 
I dropped work, but I was just glad to have my sight back, so I collapsed in my plane seat, exhausted, emotional, and looking like a complete wreck. Just when you feel like you know how much of a disaster you are as a person, and how much you can actually flop in one day, something like this will happen and put you back in your place. Defeated and humiliated, I reached into my bag to get my headphones out, and that is when suddenly a sweet-smelling ray of hope appeared and reminded me that life was still muffin? worth living. My pistachio muffin. I the muffin. reach muffin for a box the day. that looks like it's been hit by a truck <laughs> with cream leaking out of the sides and pull out this fluffy pile of rubble and place it on the tray table in front of me. I had never seen an object that represented me as much as that muffin. The I can imagine. Coming along, collecting the trash, asks if she wants to take that from me, and Phil leans over, aware that several people are looking at me right now as they enter the plane, and just says, come on, Dan, you don't really want that, do you? This was so much more than a snack at this point. It was my pride. <laughs> so with a single tear falling from my left eye, crumbed, cascading down my body like an avalanche of shame and my dignity in shreds. I ate the fucking muffin and I savoured every goddamn bite. And that you are my hero. How I nearly blinded myself. Yeah. Clapping for his bravery. Like, like an old lady. Don't look at me. See more videos that might make you feel like you've put shit together compared to me. And you can <laughs> watch the first video that made me late over there, which might explain a lot. To so he was see. drinking before he got on a plane, or he was not drinking and he just fooled all of us because taking like ten shots before you get on a flight would have probably the made best it worse. Thing you can ever do. Well, you can take like two or three shots, that's okay no. probably, but if you take like ten shots like he did in the video and just continuously drinking, he would have vomited Maybe his eye out. Maybe the vodka was his safe for the eye. Yeah, maybe so it's it, him. Yeah. Yes. I don't think so. Well, whatever. Well, first of all, I really like that shirt on him. Like, give it to me, please. Um, I like everything on him. Yeah, I knew you would say that. Well, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So that was Dan's new video. I feel you, buddy. I do. Like, we all do. It's it's a metaphor. Yes, a little bit. But, I, but I also understand Phil. But yeah. I would, I would be, be the so guy annoyed. who screams at Vika Probably me. all the time. So, yeah. Hurry up! Hurry up! Wait! 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 And then you... Yeah, because yeah. I'm always late to everything and yes. I also don't pack like the minute before I have to leave. Yes. I just start packing. Yeah, uh, I had something similar to this. I mean, he just told me he sprayed perfume in his eye. Yes. Yeah, because apparently but everyone does that at some point yeah. in their life, but I haven't yet, so it's yet to come. Because you can't see the thing where yeah, yeah, the where perfume comes out. comes out because it's black and the yeah, whole well, thing is black. Well, there's th that's the point where you look at it. I always look no. at it like, oh, okay, there it is. But, but do you... Do you the, 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 okay, you see it, but perfume... I, I never see it. It's always... Yeah, okay, that's maybe because um, all the perfume for man is like always black and grenade yeah. shaped and like so manly and everything grenade. for yeah, bomb, bomb yeah, Tanks. literally and everything for women and for girls is like pink and fluffy and silver and gold and stuff. That's because that's probably why you could see it. But there was one day where I um, was putting on like hairspray. And oh. I usually, I never do that, but the thing is, I didn't spray it in my eye. I was um, doing that, I was spraying it, and I usually don't do that, I don't use hairspray, but it was one of those days where it was so rainy that my hair would have gotten like Einstein, you know, and uh, so I just sprayed a little bit. But at this, at this moment, when I was spraying, oh, I no. felt a sneeze coming. Oh god. And you know before you sneeze, you inhale like very deep? Yes. So oh, I inhaled do all of that spray that was right above my head coming down towards my mouth. I inhaled it and I literally, for the rest of the day, felt like 
everything inside my mouth, like like back in, in the back of my mouth, was sticking together, and it was so gross. I was coughing. I felt like I was like I'm about to cough up blood. It was so gross. It was sticky. It it felt like I had the worst ache ever. I don't know. It was mm -hmm. ugh. I couldn't. Speak. I always do this with hairspray, deodorant, perfume, everything. I I'm oh, like. You're <laughs> that's, that's exactly what I not. That's what I learned from the hairspray incident. I spray, I don't breathe. I go like five meters oh, away and I'm, then I breathe. I'm like Darth Vader. I I'm starting to inhale the whole whole cloud of dust in the room. <laughs> I'm like, ah, help me. So yeah, moral of the story. But just one don't. What th one thing you should do when you spray something in your eye, you have to wink blink blink yeah. blink uh, a lot because yeah. then you start to uh, then the tears come tears out your eye and the spray shit thing will come out that's always what really? I really you look very stupid but I, I don't <laughs> like, when I like want to make myself cry for example when there is a um, what is it called I can't remember what, what is this called I'm sorry I'm, I'm not I'm, 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 I'm not good at English um, well when one of these yeah. boys gets into my eye and I just can't get it out or when you rub it too much and then your eye gets red I cannot blink fast enough to make my eye tear up so I just hold it open when and when I start it getting like um, dry yes. I just close it and then I start tearing up yes but That's tears are the best thing when yeah. you have something yeah, in your yeah tears are there to wash yeah. your eyes tears on the ground tears on my pillow you won't bring me down and I'll get over you well, that, was, that was random. We are so sorry. Yes. Well, I think we've been random, talking okay. on for so long. I mean, it was already a 10, 11 yes, minutes. We are video, sorry. So we are sorry. But I hope you enjoyed it and you watched it with us. Please comment down below if you have anything to say yes. or tell us stories if you also like sprayed. I mean, you probably also commented on Dan's video if you did that. But comment on our video too if you had an incident like that or inhaled hairspray or got something in your eye. If you eye. do this every day. <laughs> yeah, if you do this every if you inhale something every day, like I don't know. Okay. So yeah, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, I mean, we love watching Dan and Phil's videos. Very much. Very, very much. And um, if you yeah. want to see more, subscribe right here yeah somewhere there somewhere yeah. there if you want to see our last video just click over there and somewhere i'm gonna link our own channels on our faces or in the description down below yeah so just let's let's chit chat bye okay bye we're out bye